completes the second of the Giroux beginner activities, you are asked to write your initials on the board. This is a simple extension to the first activity where you only had to write one letter, the letter J. Let's say that your initials are JB and you wanted to create the pattern shown here. We're going to describe one additional shortcut or Giroux trick that can help you shorten your code. Let's say I just finished writing the letter J and the Giroux, as shown here, is positioned in this position. And we want to move the Giroux from this position here, which is the 4-9 cell, over here to the 4-12 cell so we can start writing the letter B. How could we do this? Well, one way is we could simply write the word hop three times. Let's see how this works. We see that the Giroux eventually arrives at the letter B. But you can see that repeating code like this can be monotonous and time consuming. We can instead use a shortcut by hopping the Giroux three spots all in one step. Let's see how to do this. We can achieve the same effect as before, except in a single line of code, by putting a number inside the hop method. This indicates how far we want the Giroux to hop. Let's run this one and see what happens. Now as I do the one step hop, I see the Giroux instantly goes from here all the way to here. This may help shorten your code as you work on writing your initials.